Hello and welcome back to yet again a new wonderful story time. As always, every Tuesday I enjoy seeing your lovely faces. So yes, I hope you guys can smack that like button and make me a little bit more happy. And let's go ahead and get into the story that we are going to be speaking about today. So, the story we will be speaking on today is on the category of smoking. Smoking. A lot of people will say it's bad for you. I would agree with them. Probably not too great for your lungs, unless you're doing some sort of vapor. I don't even know. I mean, it's only been out for a little while. I mean, back in the day, they used to think that smoking was good for your heart. I mean, this is something I can't make up. I mean, they honestly were like, oh, it's good for your heart. No, no, don't worry. Anybody says differently is stupid and they need to go die. So, no. Smoking is bad for you, plain and simple. Now, will you do it? That's your decision. This is your life that you live, and it's my life that I live. And I have not smoked a cigarette or done the marijuana ever. So, what I have done, though, is hookah. Some of you may or may not have known or know what hookah is, but it's like this, it's like a tasty type of smoking. Um, and I decided to go to this hookah bar with some friends, and uh, we had a lovely time. Uh, I was very, I was very, uh, kind of turned off on the idea of actually doing something that is smoking. And when I had actually told my mother that I did go to what is known as a hookah bar, she honestly thought it was some sort of really bad drug. She was just like, are you doing drugs? I was like, no. It's got like a very small amount of nicotine in it, which it does. It does have a small amount of nicotine, but it's not like I was scratching to go back the next day. I mean, I went back like a, uh, like a month later. I've probably been to a hookah bar probably, oh, six or seven times in my entire life. So, did I have a good time? Yeah. Why did I have a good time? Not because of the damn smoke. I had a good time because I was with friends. Now, I don't know if people have good times actually smoking cigarettes. I'm sure they have a good time smoking marijuana or weed. I keep feeling weird. I feel really white when I say marijuana. I don't know why. Maybe it's because I am white. Um, but, uh, yeah, no. Uh, I had a good time because I was at a place with friends and we were having a good time. Which I did. I did have a good time. And uh, would I do it again? Yeah. Um, but, uh, you know... I think something on the lines of smoking, especially cigarettes, is something that should be, uh, be careful with it. Be careful with it, because I'd hate for any of you to get hurt or sick because of smoking. Uh, but it is your body. It is your body, and I want you to be able to do with what you want with it. But just know that you need to be careful, as do I need to be careful with hookah. Uh, it does have a small amount of nicotine, and technically I am breathing in smoke. So, who's to say that I will die of cancer? No one knows. I did breathe in a little bit of smoke. Who knows? Smoke? I mean, smoke. So, um, yeah. Um, if you're going to smoke, just be careful about it. And, uh, yeah. Also, be careful with these vapor things. I'm going to be completely honest. I feel like something's going to happen with those. I feel like there's going to be, like, this new breed of cancer that's brought in by steam. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, but, yeah. My story is, I've smoked, but I've never smoked a cigarette, or I've never smoked weed, but I have, in fact, smoked hookah. I've seen the, the, the comment smoke quite often, and I thought I should go ahead and tackle uh, this topic. My view on smoking is you just need to be careful if you're going to do it, and if you're going to do it, just know that you may have something to worry about later in life. And I don't want anybody to be like, oh my gosh, I have lung cancer? You were smoking cigarettes, don't don't be surprised. But I've known people that have smoked cigarettes, gotten lung cancer, and still smoked. There was a guy that lived near my house when I was younger. He used to scare the living hell out of me and my younger brother. And that was a guy who had gotten lung cancer and he had to get the, the hole in his throat, which he had the robotic little voice thingy. He scared the living shit out of me and my brother when we were younger because, I, mean, I mean, this guy was terrifying. He's dead now, but he still smoked. And he was one of those hardcore smokers where he smoked out of the hole in his throat. So, smoking can be something that's very addictive, and for this man, he kept doing it even after he had gotten lung cancer. And who's to say that you'll even get cancer? You don't know, I don't know, doctors don't know. Some people just will be able to be okay with it. So, my viewpoint on smoking, don't do it, but if you're gonna do it, just know that you could die. So, 
<laughs> you got to take those risks in life, I suppose. If you get in a car, you have a chance of dying too, I suppose. So yes, I hope you guys enjoyed this lovely little topic that we were able to talk about today. As always, if you haven't SLC'd with sense or sub, like, and comment, you're more than welcome to. If you want to see more of these little story times, then yes, subbing is going to allow you to see these every Tuesday. Liking just pretty much helps me be happy. If you want me to be happy, then you're more than welcome to hit that little like button and comment your ideas of what you'd like to see next week. I enjoy when you guys can do that as well. And yes, as you can see, we have built the elephant face, and this is going to be the base of the front of the castle that we will be building. I'm going to incorporate this actual cave into the build, and I think I'm going to have a small dungeon area, so that's why I'm working with that right now. So, as always, I guess I'll say good day and goodbye, so yes, good day and goodbye.